Welcome back to Character Select. Dave, back for more Armored Core 2. We have conquered the arena. And now, well, we still conquer it, right? Yeah. Are there new guys? There are new guys. All right, we're gonna start off by kicking the shit out of these guys. Um, hopefully. Yeah, he's got vert missiles. He's got that big machine gun. Okay, we'll do Scarlet first. Um, yeah, for for anybody that's terribly curious, I am recording this. I don't even know what I have equipped. Uh oh. Uh, I am recording this on Christmas Day. It's about ten thirty in the morning, and I was super lazy about uh, getting ready for the weekend this week. So I kind of have to. Boop. 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 Oh, you think you can slice me? Say hello to Moonlight Blade! You don't want to get into a sword off with me. But yeah. It's, uh... So yeah, it's Christmas Day. Um... My wife is over at her parents. I am not at her parents because I have to interact with people, so I am still socially distancing. Uh, and therefore, I am chilling the F out at home. I uh, haven't opened gifts yet. Uh, we, get, we went and got all the gifts from my parents. She's bringing back gifts from her parents and all that stuff and families, I should say. So we're going to take care of that once she's back home. Man, that person died. Cool. Um, but yeah, it's the, uh, it's the end of the freaking year. When did that happen? This has been the longest, shortest year ever. I swear to God. Hey, 10,000 money. I don't need money at this point. All right, I'm going to swap out my parts here. Did I sell my handgun? I sold my handgun. Like a genius. Alright, fuck it. We're going shotgun, baby. Oops. He's a tank AC. He probably can't do much. Equipment for enemy radar jamming? When did I get that? Those look cool AF! Uh, we'll grab these. Okay. But yeah, this has been, it feels like the longest, shortest year at times. Uh, it feels like it's flown by. Oops, that's not what I wanted to fight. It feels like it's flown by, and it also feels like it's taken forever. So, I hope your 2020 wasn't, I don't want to say, I want to say, I hope it was good, but given the way that 2020 has been for most people, I'm pretty sure that's not the case. Ow, 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 ow. You son of a bitch. Get back here. I'm thinking of doing like a an end of the end of the year wrap up for New Year's Day. So I might do a vlog that day. But in the meantime, we are working on finishing up a armored core. Among other things, we still got Ghost of Tsushima to finish. This has been a good year for games, though. I gotta say that. Lots of time to play them. Well, for the most part. A um, lot of really good games coming out. Oh, fuck. I need to get behind. Nope. No, 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 no. Ah, you got me. Wow, I'm impressed, dude. You were beefy.
Um, but yeah, it's been it's been a year. It's definitely been a year. Uh, I think the pandemic has changed enough that uh, nothing is the same anymore. Oh my god, dude. Enough with the fucking grenade launcher, please. He's got a lot of energy defense. He's got a lot of defense in general, Jesus. Well, this is interesting, right? This is quality content, everybody. Um, I also think that we've played a lot of really interesting games this year. Oh, where is that going? Oops. Fuck that building, I guess. I don't know if vert missiles will work in here. Find out in a moment. How am I not fucking hitting you? God, this guy has so much freaking armor. Oh my god, really? Bastard. Um... <clears throat> It's really hard to have coherent thoughts when I'm fighting in giant robots. Fun. Um, we played a lot of really good games this year. I'm struggling to think of what we played at the beginning of the year, but we've definitely played a lot of good ones by the end of the year. So, um, And I'm looking forward to games that we're also going to play later, uh, because I think they could be a lot of fun. All right, I know how I'm going to kill this guy. It's not even going to be hard. This upstart thinks that he can fight with me. Ha. Huh. Doop. Um. <clears throat> but yeah, I hope, I do hope that everybody's had a, a decent day or a decent year. I know it's been a tough one. Are you going to be smart like the beast was? Nope. Oh, he also has a vert missile launcher. Where do you think you're going? Trixie Hobbit thinks he's a Trixie Hobbit. God, he has so much defense. Oh, and he's overheating. Nice. Boop, 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 boop. How did you become the champion? Well, I stood on top of a building and I fired missiles at people that were too stupid to get out of the way. Oh man, his emergency cooling is really good. Oops.
Really? Really? Fuck. Fuck that guy. Jesus, that armor is really good. I'm impressed, dude. Not impressed enough to, you know, not kill you. But... I think it was... <clears throat> And we got 15,000 credits. Sweet. Once again, everybody in the arena that's alive has died. So now we're going to do the thing that we were supposed to do before I realized there were two more people to fight. Boop, boop. We're going to go get us a real good gun. Now, I we might have to do this mission a couple of times because I don't actually remember where the gun is. And the guides that tell you where it is are not very helpful. Blah, 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 blah. We've seen this in the last episode. Yes, no. Possibly. So we're going to put our radar back on, and we're going to switch back to our small missiles. And go with the pulse rifle. Now, one other thing in the comments. Apparently, the comment about... Um, I can equip that? Nice. The comment about the uh, booster was actually incorrect. There is a booster that's bugged, but it's not that one. It's not the, the one that I had. So we're going to swap that back in because... Boost power 21,000. Because I like going fast. But I also like not running out of boost. Yeah, we'll go with the Gex. The Gex 3000. Put those parts on. Click, click. All right. Ba -da -da! Okay. Clo. Operation Clo. We'll be working together on this mission. It's a pleasure to meet you, Raven. I'm sure it is, right up until you try to stab Large me in the back. That's a big thing. I'll be watching your back. Good luck. Now, we have to go, I believe, to where they started from. I just left the area. Oops. Well, we're going to have to reload that, because that is an absolute failure. And now we've got... Annoying Crackleys on my preview. Well, it's amazing how quickly you can fucking mess up, right? Jesus Christ. Oop. All right, let's look up where that is. Sorry, give me a second here. And it's absolutely vitally important that we get this part like you you don't even know
Okay. And it's entirely possible, and in fact likely, that we could fail this mission just because the uh, getting the part and getting back in time is difficult. All right, we won't worry about the booster this time. We'll deal with that later. Nyaaah! Okay. Who needs so bad if I can skip these? It's a pleasure to meet you, Raven. Large heat source detected. Now you might be wondering, why the hell am I in an AC and that's supposedly better if those MTs are bigger than I am? MTs are not as good at muscle tracing. ACs are superior. Oh shit, that's not good. Boop. I don't even know if that's helping. If you guys could fucking stop shooting me for half a fucking second! Alright, that's one. That's two. That's on the other side. Oh my god, at least they're not doing a lot of damage. At least. That's a shame. I don't think I have enough ammo for this. There it is. AC part acquired. Now we just have to actually grab it. Er, win. Yeah, I don't think I have enough ammo for this. I should have gotten a thousand machine gun gun. So we might have to restart. Go oh, rockets. Rockets would be really good on this mission. See, there's this whole other side, right? Like, holy crap, there's a lot of shit to kill in this thing. And we're about to leave the air in here, so that's not helpful. And I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo. System System switch to normal mode. I don't know if this is going to result in a game over. We might have to do this again. This mission is hard. Yeah, game over. <laughs> okay. Mission is hard because you have to be fast. You have to have enough ammo. And you have to get that part. Because that part is the most important part in the game. No, not new game. Fuck. All right, hold on. Boop. Reset. Yes. Press the PS button. Press the PS to resistance button. Honestly, the PlayStation 2 had just a massive number of games, didn't it? Start load game. I think I saw like a, a listing somewhere of uh, systems that had the most games and the PlayStation 2 was just barely in the lead over the PlayStation 3. No. 
PlayStation 2 was just in second place behind the Wii, but I don't really consider the Wii to have a lot of good games. It just has a lot of games, because it was cheap to develop for. So, all right, assembly. Let's see here. Energy sniper rifle is definitely not gonna help me. I don't think that has enough ammo either. All right, to the shop. Uh, while we're here, we'll get the Gex. Because why not? We're here. Machine gun with increased ammo. There we go. It's not very strong, but oh boy, does it have a lot of ammunition. Alright, and then rockets are going to be good. Or grenade launcher, but I'd have to kneel down. It's really heavy. <clears throat> That's pretty heavy too. I don't know if we're going to be able to mount it, so just in case, we will buy small rockets with lots of ammo. 40 is not a lot of ammo, dude. Oddly enough, back parts are the only parts that you can buy three of because technically it can't limit you to buying only it can't limit you to buying only one because it doesn't know if you might want to mount two. But it can't limit you to mounting two, so it just doesn't limit you. <laughs> it's interesting. Boop. Overweight. How much overweight? Uh, like a hundred. Mm. Alright, we'll worry about that another time. Boop. Unless... Like a hundred. God damn it. All right, just because we just changed a lot of shit, we will save the game again. Also, I recently replayed just a bit of Armored Core 4. And oh my God, this game feels like you're wading through mud in comparison to Armored Core 4. Like, Armored Core 4 is fast and very hard to follow. I only played it for like 10 minutes because I didn't want to get too used to it. We'll be working together on this mission. You'll be dying together on this to mission. You, it's a pleasure to meet you, meat. Large heat source detected. I'll be watching your back. Good luck. Main system, engaging combat mode. See? Already dead. Stop it! Oh my god, the slowdown is real. Already? Wow, he didn't last long at all. Nope, wrong targets. That's the other thing that I really don't like about this game is the inability to choose your targets. It's just like, oh, you want to target something? Here, I'll arbitrarily choose this. Nope, nope, fucking stop it! Alright, I've killed everything on the side, so... Grab that. Boom! Should be working on the one at the front. Die, die, please. Thank you. Good. 
objective achieved. Systems I only had to use three quarters of my fucking machine gun ammo. <laughs> Jesus. Good God. I still got a pretty good payoff for that, actually. I'm surprised they didn't give me a reward for keeping that MT alive, but oh well. Who cares? We got the best thing in the game. Hi, I have new mail. Sweet. Belena product announcement, Zeo Matrix Earth HQ takeover of Emerald. All right. An agreement has been reached where Emerald will surrender to and come under full control of the LLC. Their Earth headquarters has also announced that they will obey the Earth government. Though gradual government governmental pressure er, through gradual governmental pressure, Emerald will be stripped of its power. For all intents and purposes, in all intents and purposes, not intensive purposes, Emerald is finished. Great changes will occur on Mars depending on how Zeo and Belena play their cards. Either way, a raven can only carry out orders. Once a path has been chosen, it must be followed to its end. It seems the relationship between Zeo Matrix Earth Headquarters and its Mars Division is deteriorating rapidly. Their Earth Headquarters does not want to damage its ties to the Earth government, but the Mars Division's only concern is consolidating power. Our informants say they're about to split. The Mars Division has always conducted itself in a devious manner. What are they planning to do? We will contact you if we learn anything new. This is an announcement in regards to a new part added to the shop. It is the best, the very best, the culmination of Belena know-how. Head over to the shop and see our superior creation for yourself. Technology is the key when designing weapons. Technology is the power that changes the world. And it is Belena that has the most technological prowess. Alright. So most importantly, we got a new weapon. And what weapon did we get? You better fucking believe it's the Karasawa Mark II. Mmm! I am overweight and I don't even care. We'll fix that in a minute. Let's see what this part is. Thanks for telling me where to look for it. Uh, so it's not a head because that doesn't have any bees. Cores? Nope. Arms? Nope. I'm willing to bet that it's a weapon. Let's just go right to weapons. Let's see if it's there. Z E E Z Z Z Z Z There. Back weapon, maybe? Multifunction with various sensors. High end model with wide wide range radar. Well, one of those. Huh. Is it an L unit? No. What did you guys fucking add? Jesus Christ. It's a missile interceptor. That could be it. Who makes that? Emerald. No. Radiator, maybe? High level with stable performance. That's actually really good. I'm gonna get this. It doesn't weigh as much as the other one, that's why it's really good. High output model, small red zone. Ooh. Ooh. That can be good and bad. Seen that one. Long range single type. Right area single type. Boosters? No. Legs. Oh, and in case you're wondering, yes, that means that we will not be getting any further missions from uh, Emerald, I believe. Yeah, Belena doesn't make, like, structural parts. They make weaponry. Or support stuff. Wait, what about optional parts? Expands capacitor on generator? Ooh. Produces cannon recoil, one enjoyment power, missile display, 
Reduces lock on time is actually not bad. Speeds up energy weapon fire, not bad. Reduces energy from firing, really not bad. Sends pulses that disable lock ons, eh. Flares misses on full lock on, increases lock on. That capacitor thing would be pretty good. All right, let's see how we can set up our mech so that we're not fucking overweight. First things first, swap that back to radar. Hey, look, we're no longer overweight. Sweet. So this is quite a bit heavier, but it's almost as good a performance as this and like two thirds the weight. This is slightly heavier. It's got better energy output. It's got a smaller red zone. The red zone is the little bit of red in the in the energy bar that drains slower. So a small red zone means that you get into that emergency use area much later, but you burn through it faster. So it's a kind of a risk reward thing. Oh yeah, we are operating right at the edge, aren't we? Yeah. All of these things waste so much. All right, let's see how we can reduce our weight here. This act, that actually isn't a very helpful item, so we'll skip that. Oh yeah, baby, we got the Moonlight Blade. We got the Karasawa Mark II. We have a still perfect mission accomplishment rate because now we're in the point where we're just going to start fucking dying if we fail. And this is where the game gets a little tricksy hobbitses. <clears throat> Wait, we're still at 100%. Yeah, we've done 20 missions, we've succeeded 100 times. We've done 89 arena challenges and we've succeeded 51% or 51 times. Which, you know, not bad. Considering all the stuff that you have to do. Escort submarine? Is that a special mission? Nope. We request that you board our submarine and protect it en route to its destination. The submarine is transporting the recovered file, so we must be prepared for attempts by LCC and Belena to regain them. Please stand by until needed. LCC has an impressive naval arsenal, which includes aircraft carriers. Many dangers await us. Be prepared for any and all eventualities. All right. We're going to have to actually swap out our weapon load here. Uh, actually, we're going to have to swap out a couple of things. First things first, I don't want to be in another situation where I can't fucking aim, as you might remember from Armored Core 1, so we're going to have to change the FCS. This is also the only mission that we have available, so it's the mission that we have to do, which is kind of annoying. Uh, I really want to bring the Karasawa, but it's not going to be helpful this time. What's the range on this thing? 315, 350. And that should free up some space to... Wow, can I not buy a second one of those missile launchers? Huh. Interesting. I must have gotten that missile launcher from a special mission or something. That's all I can think of.
Oh no, I already have two. Never mind, you can only buy two. Haha, <laughs> I was totally wrong. Alright. Blah blah blah. Gargle. Operation Gargle. There's a name for you. Unidentified units detected on radar. Okay. What do you want me to do about it? We can't dive. The water is too shallow. Oh. Alright. You've got to protect us. Do my best. Main system. Engaging combat mode. Problem is, I don't have a radar now. Your AC cannot be recovered should it fall into the ocean. You have been warned. Oh, falling into the ocean means death. Gotcha. Enemy battle Enemy Command what? Attack. So, my helm- my head unit does have a basic radar, so I'm not completely crippled, but might as well be- oh, hello. Ow, ow! Alright, fine, we'll do this. Wait, why am I doing that? Vertical launch missile bays! Uh-oh. Huh! Can't believe you pulled that off. Oh boy. That was risky. But as Third likes to say, sometimes you gotta risk it to get the brisket. Oh shit, that was bad. Oh shit, that was bad. Enemy aircraft approaching. I know, I'm shooting them now. It's a problem. Why do these missiles suck at tracking these things? Jesus. Oh, there's one behind me. Come on, man. Ah, fuck. Looked up and I meant to look down. These bombers shouldn't be able to dodge these missiles, but they keep dodging my fucking missiles! What the hell? God, that's frustrating. Seriously? Uh, what is that? Okay, so missiles are not the proper solution in this mission. Also, I died. Oh no, I didn't die. Interesting. We're gonna reload, though. Like, oh, I hate these escort missions. They're the worst. Do I get to do it again? I do. But, we're gonna keep that 100% mission rate. That's why we haven't stolen any parts. Or have we? 
Did we steal any parts this time? I honestly don't remember. Alright. I can't believe missiles suck that much on that mission. Alright, so knowing that missiles suck, the multi-warheads could work, but I only have 24 of those, which isn't enough. Or 14 of them. Hmm. The rockets could help me take out the, the battleship without having to fly over to it, which could be helpful. You want to keep that radar as well. Uh, What's your range? Sight range is 351. That's not nearly enough. Okay. What can we do to improve our chances here? Some of these would be really great if they had more ammo, but most of them have shit ammo. What's your range? 500. 750. 880. 478. And then this takes up a back slot, which means that it's not as helpful as you might think. Those are all radars. Fires a pod that attacks with missiles. And Gatling, shoulder metal plasmas. Uh, none of these options are great. Yes, do, 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 do. Get some assemblage going here. That could be useful in taking out the battleship with its own vertical launch missile rocket launcher, but honestly, it doesn't seem like it would be. System, save, because I don't want to do that again. Uh, I hate escort missions. It was bad in the first game, and it's not that great in this one either. I love how I, <laughs> if you look at the mission list, it's like sortie 16, 30, or er, sortie 18, uh, 32,000 credits. Sortie 19, 3 million credits. Blah, 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 blah. Just because I did the arena and all that time. The arena just gives out free money. Gargle. Alright. So we gotta fuck up these flyers as quickly as possible and not waste missiles on them. We can't dive. The water is too shallow. If the water is too shallow to dive, why are you going this way? Main system. Combat mode. Your AC cannot be recovered should it fall into the ocean. You have been warned. Fuck you. Enemy battles are detected. Commence attack. not here yet. I gotta wait until it shows up. Really? These The, the infinitely spawning ace uh, flight things are also really annoying, by the way. In case anybody's thinking that that's not the case. 
See, now they hit. What's up with that? Oh, God. Okay, Battlecruiser's here. And these things are too low to the ground for me to hit. Oh god, I'm tanking with my body. It hurts. Alright, the battle cruiser is dead. Those are gonna hit. They did. Enemy aircraft approaching. I know. One thing I really don't like is the correction phase for all of the uh, weapons, where you have to like it has to lead the target for a bit before it'll let you actually hit it. What? How do you fucking figure I was doing great? Oh my god, this mission sucks. Yeah, it's Sortie 18, 24,000 credits. Sortie 19, 3.5 million credits. It's just fun to me. All right, next time on Character Select, uh, we will try this mission one more time, hopefully succeed, and see what happens. So thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it, and I'll see you guys with this game in the new year, baby. 2021, it's coming.